He climbs to the top of this mountain. You can see how close the drivers go to that wall. They have to let the car fade to the right. They're very conscious of that it's a wall waiting for them. If they miss it, again here at Repco, up onto the shelf, down through Castro Dip. Nice through there. He's got his confidence up. Let's see if Dab of the Dape brake lights zip. A little one. Car's fairly steady here. He's giving it plenty. Now for the first break over Skyline. Re-accelerate. Brake. Re-accelerate. Through the dip. And now the acceleration down to Forest Elbow. Only a small team, Castrol Ford, but very effective. Barry Seaton coming on board this year to build the engines. Time he's got to beat at 2.11.77. Alan Jones currently at the top of the timesheets. Mm, this looks like about 2.12 plus to me, the way it's going as he comes down into uh, Murray's corner, bottom of the hill, takes the last oh. left hander, puts the wheel up over the kerb, stops the clock at 2.12, 3.2, Tony Longhurst. And that's not quite good enough to put him up towards the front end of the grid, unfortunately.